Celebrating Tampa Bay's multicultural history. It's what an Ybor City nonprofit wants to do by bringing new life to an iconic building that was once a safe haven for Spanish immigrants. Here's ABC Action News reporter Sean Daly with how you can help beautify Centro Asturiano. When you walk through these doors, you feel taken back right to 1914 when this particular building opened. I am getting an epic tour of one of the most important buildings in Tampa Bay. Ybor City's Centro Astoriano. This is unbelievable. This was once a safe haven and mutual aid society for Spanish immigrants who helped build Tampa Bay. All parts theater, bank, hospital, and more. Crystal Lastra is the president of Centro Astoriano, which is now a nonprofit that still serves the community, from a cigar social club to glorious wedding ballrooms. So this building is not only important to immigrants that came from Spain, it's important to the community in Tampa to remember that Tampa is here because Ybor City was here first. Built in the Renaissance Mediterranean style, Centro Astoriano is maintained by a small staff. Maintenance is never ending. Ending. One of the oldest working theaters in Florida is here, and it needs a lot of TLC, especially the seating. So Crystal and her staff are launching a fundraising effort starting March 23rd with a Take a Seat Gala open to the public. We want generations from now to walk in here and have the same awe that you did a few minutes ago, and that's the importance of restoring it and making sure that it's part of Ybor City's revitalization. If you have never been to Centro Astoriano, you need to come like right now. Come have a seat next to me. And if you'd like to help them out, and you really should, head on over to abcactionnews.com and I have all that information for you. In Ybor City, I'm Sean Daly.